Welcome back. Thank you for being here because I'm such a great storyteller. So the story today is about how my grandparents, my papa, thinks that I was a great grandchild while my grandmother was trying to convince him that I was the reason why the situation is the way it was. So what happened was, back in the day, well, yeah, my grandmother loves to go to bingo. So you know those little like ink things where you like dot it with that bottle thing? Well, since I was an only child for like the longest time and my grandparents has two sets of stairs at their house. One set, it doesn't even matter, it brings you to the other side of the house, but the other one for the front bedrooms, instead of like stairs going down it like to a basement, that one had like a closet inside there with like, I don't know, file cabinets or whatever. So, you know, you have to make your own fun when you're a kid. So, I took those ink things for the bingo piece of paper and I covered that room's walls like it was my job. Like I was an interior designer and I was just stamping it like a Dalmatian. Like, you deserve a dot, you deserve a dot. And then, so fast forward to like many years later, my papa is remodeling the house, like getting things new painted and whatever. And something happened. A conversation was brought up about that room. Why was there ink on the thing? And by this time, there's three other grandchildren for sure. And they're like, oh, it's probably just them. Why would his favorite grandson do something like that? And so I go, what happened? And they're like, there was like the, what is it? The bingo ink that I can't think of, whatever it's, whatever it's called. And I go, oh yeah, that was me. And he was like, what? I was like, yeah, that was me. I did that. I mean, I was bored. Like I had, no one was watching me. You know, I literally, my mom was thankful, you know, that I had a babysitter, but my grandparents were just like, yeah, have chocolate, do whatever you want. So, literally, I painted your walls for free, and you didn't love it. <laughs> so, that is me, like, just being naughty. And, you know, it's kind of funny to look back at it now, because, like, I didn't get in trouble for it then, because obviously my Lola knew that I did that, because she told my papa that... I was the one why there was the ink everywhere. But you know, it's just funny when you look back at things and you're just like, just living. It's like when kids cut their hair, kinda, right? I don't really know. It's like, I don't know. My sister's done some things where she painted things where nobody's watching either. So it's not that bad, it's normal. Like just keep an eye on us, I guess, you know? So that's my little story time. Thank you for watching. Until next time, hopefully something else good or better will happen. Or write something in the comments that you like actually watching from me, and then we'll see how well I can do that. Bye. Bye, Grizzly Bear. Bye.